Uh, welcome back, everyone, to another episode of the Ottoman Empire, where we are playing the Sir mod, and we're about to do a major invasion. I think you guys already know what the invasion is. You guys have been waiting for it, you know, really, really patiently. And I think it's time, finally time to bring it to you guys, the invasion of the French. So, yeah, I'm going to wait. I'm going to actually wait for just... Let's see. Let's also convert this to a state for some reason because I can't. But I'm actually going to wait just a little bit longer because I do want to get these troops in position because I want to get Wuttenberg out of the war as soon as possible. Okay? Like as soon as Wuttenberg gets into this war, I want to get them out of this war. I mean, I have enough little tiny vassals to help me out here, but I just want to make sure that they're out of this war as quickly as possible and you guys need to heal up. So I'm going to wait a month. And then once that tick comes, well then I'm done. Let's see. Yes, okay. Let's see. I oh, mean, you guys are also building up. Well, you guys are a little bit late building up, so I won't count you guys. Actually, is there any, like, do I have to mind anyone over here? Not really. Not really. And if, if they, if the Scandinavians try to do anything, I'll just kill them. Okay? Everyone ready? You got your hats on? So, everyone, three, two, one, go! Okay. France is now the good one. We're going to instantly do this. Everyone! Across the strait! <laughs> this is the British invasion, everyone! The British are coming! The British are coming! Okay, you guys go right here, you guys go right there, 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 you guys go right there. Okay! An entire line, okay? The treacherous Japan had just betrayed me. Huh. Thank you, Japan! You inspired my faith in your people! Okay! Alright, and it seems like you guys joined in. Go kill you guys before you guys become too much of a burden on my people. Okay? Because I don't want to deal with any of your guys' stuff. Alright? And before we, before I forget, call in everyone that's a part of my alliance sphere. Oh my goodness, this is going to take a little bit. So let's see. Lithuania, you guys are coming in. Uh, you guys over here, Latvia. You guys are coming in. Estonia, you guys are coming in. Alright, let's see what else. You guys of Armenia is gonna come in. Let's see. Then you guys over here of Afghanistan gonna come in. Let's see. Then you right here of Romania. You guys are already in the war, so I don't even have to worry about you. Alright, and then Bohemia. Hey, bro. It's time for you to come into this war. Uh, do I want to call in any of my little boys? Eh, we can call them Baden just because they're right near the border. Baden, you guys get to come in. <laughs> Uh, anyone else that might have a decent sized army? Eh, yeah, they're, they're, they're not really, they're okay. Okay, and let's see, and I'm also going to call in the Kino of Mozambique. It's going to be their first, the first real war. I'm so excited for them. Okay, you guys go crush these guys, you guys go right here, go start seizing up these. I'm also going to call in South Africa because South Africa deserves also a little chance to go take over some land. And let's see, anyone else I need to call in? Nope. Okay, well, I could call, hey, you know what, I could call in our uh, good friends the Philippines. Why not? Philippines, you guys get to come in. I think I won't call in our good city-state vassal, this, the Republic of Malaysia, just because, eh, I don't think I'll need him in this war. And let's see, is there anything else? Oh, shoot, I completely forgot about over here. Okay, um, you guys, go crush the French army right here, and then we're going to go try a siege up. So let's see, there's three theaters of war I have to deal with. This theater of war... This theater of war, this theater of war, and this theater of war. Okay, so we do have to kind of maintain good perspective about everything. Seems like most of these guys made it across the channel. That's good. I was, I was hoping none of them like died in weird sort of, you know, abstract ways. You know, because there, there are weird abstractions. I do admit, there's weird abstractions you can get from dying. Okay, and let's see. You guys get across the channel now. Go, go, get across the channel. Okay. Oh, and let's see, we have all this invasion going on pretty quickly. Oh, it seems like Italy did not join in the war to defend their good ally, the French. Hmm. Alright, that's kind of interesting. So right now we're... <coughs> oh my goodness, sorry people. So right now we're looking at an independent war with, with uh, Italy. Huh. I would not have guessed I would have had to go to war with Italy. You guys go right here, go defend against these guys. Yeah. 
101 versus 41, I'm pretty sure we're going to win that battle. Let's see, and then we're winning this battle over here with the Battle of uh, Wurttemberg. We're having more of our vassals come in and go destroy more of the French lands. We might be able to even destroy the France before they really even mobilize. That would be really nice. If we could just completely and utterly take them over before they even mobilize, that's going to be nice. Okay, got this land right over here. Move in right there. Let's see, how's our war going on over here? Uh, you guys did not join this unit fast enough, so this is they might be dead. Oh, gosh. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that unit might be dead. Unless, unless, unless... Yay! Go destroy them. Or die, too. So, yeah, we might have lost the South American front already. I, I didn't even really fight it that hard, but we might have already lost. Apparently, there's like an 8K unit right there. I don't really like that. You guys combine, make a unit. You guys go right here. Go start CG of that. Yeah, but just go... Me and the South... We and the South... We and the Africans are just going to chill out in the lower part of Africa. They, they, the France can have Northern Africa. I don't really care about Northern Africa. Uh, what we care about is this part. Okay. And let's see. We're sieging up Wurttemberg pretty handily. I don't think they're going to be... Oh, they're coming for us, everyone. They're coming for us. Long live the Ottoman Empire. Okay. It seems like France is slowing us down with all these little tiny uh, immature sieges. I mean, seriously. Okay. You guys go right there. Let's see. I'm trying to think of how would I move in here. Okay, so let's see. That army's gonna move in right there. That army's gonna move in right there. We could actually kind of... I guess you guys could go right there. Let's see, right there. You guys go right there. This army's kind of gonna be by itself a little bit. You guys go right there. 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 And then right here's a little bit of a problem. So I'm just gonna move. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And let's see. Let's divide up our men. So that some of them kind of block up this side too. Let's see. Alright, yeah. This all looks good. At least I'm pretty sure. Fall back. Let's see back here down in uh, Frenchland. Let's go right here. Or French Spain. I don't know how you would pronounce that. But let's see. We have all this conquered. All this conquered. Let's see. Uh, go send like a couple units to go like distract them. Go send another unit right there to go siege up that. <laughs> Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we covered up all of our holes. Let's see, we got this being sieged up back here. Yeah, it was Estonia, France. Let's see, and then this is already done. Wow, that's already done. Okay, let's keep moving in then. Okay, let's see, you guys are going to Marshall. Exactly where I wanted you guys to go. Apparently there's an army right over here attacking me. I'm going to see if it's big enough for me to go send in more troops. In fact, just to make sure I'm going to go siege right next to them to make sure they don't kill them. Let's see, there's some troops right over there. I don't like having troops in the background, so go kill them. Okay, go kill them. Kill them all. Okay, and let's see. We could probably we could probably move out these two units right here. Get right next to... Holy! Never mind. Everyone go right here. Everyone go right there. Go protect that unit right there. I don't know what just happened, but we're going to have to go protect that unit. Yeah, that, that was not prepared at all for 106 units just to radically appear in France. Yeah, French, French have a way to just surprise you sometimes. I don't know why. Let's see, you guys combine, make a good 610 unit, I guess. Why not? Make a 610 unit. Okay, you guys move in right there. You guys right here. I mean, we're getting in a little bit more closely aligned. Alright, you guys go right there, you guys go right there, you guys go right there. Alright, let's see. Okay, yeah, you guys are gonna lose this if I don't go and go send in more men. You guys are basically finishing up in a couple days. Okay, and let's see. You guys are almost done. Let's see if we can finish. Let's go see if we can go help these guys right here. Siege up the rest of this. Let's see. Wattenberg, you want out? Sure, I don't really care about you guys. Yeah, you guys aren't really that important to the overall scheme of things. So let's go right here. Now, you guys. You guys are manning a war goal to conquest. Because I've said for a long, long time, I'm going to get you guys. And I wasn't joking about that. I'm literally going to wipe you guys out. So, I mean, if you guys remember, these guys have been on my hit list for a very, very long time. Serbia? Yeah. They're on my hit list. And next is also going to be Greece. I'm not getting those two guys out of the war. They're staying in this war for as long as it needs to happen. Let's see. That, that battle right there is kind of annoying me just a little bit. It seems like the French are having a little bit of fun down here, sieging up my land. Let's see. Down here in Africa, we've 
Didn't destroy these guys again. Go destroy them, please. Right. Can't really focus too much on this war, though, because it's more... The bigger war is going on over here, which we are annihilating the French in. Okay, let's go see. You guys go crush these army. Let's see. You guys are already doing a solid front right there. You guys... We need to go cover up right there. That's the only part that really needs to be covered up. Let's see. There's a little bit of a hole right there, so go right there. And let's see. Perry. We can go directly for Paris. Go for directly for Paris. Go. Go, 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 go. All right, there we go. All right, yay! We won the really big battle. Yay, and we killed a lot of men. Okay, okay, okay. Go slaughter that men. Go slaughter that men. Go send another army right there. Go send another army, I guess, right there. Because we really, we already have an army going to go send right there. Fall back. Okay, you guys go directly to Paris. We must conquer Paris. You guys go right here. Right, yes, warm Paris grounds. We made it to Paris, everyone. Yay. All right, we got army organization. So now we should be, we should, if we get lucky enough, we should create the, uh, um, well, oh man, Belfast, Belfast became a great power. Dang it. That means now they're going to be all like, I want equal rights and I want to actually lead campaigns and I want, uh, such whiny people. Okay, wow, that is seriously becoming a big battle down there. Okay, let's see, we have so much men. You guys go down there, and let's see, we're just crushing through. Ooh, we're kind of losing a battle down there. I'm actually going to go put some more men down there, just to kind of help us out. That's a lot of men we were losing, man. Okay, let's see, you guys move in right there. Let's see, where's the front now? I'm not even sure. Seems like my allies are helping us out, kind of. The French are kind of destroying me, kind of. Uh, let's see. Uh, for the most part, though, I believe we're winning. I believe it. I mean, it's very... I would be very shocked if it told me... I think we just lost this battle down here. No? Okay, we lost another big battle somewhere. Hmm. I really don't know where that is. Because I really don't have any clue... But we are discovering oil, so I guess there is a silver lining in all this. And let's see, there's a battle going on right there. It's probably going to include more men. We're going to need more men over here. Let's see, you guys, we don't need this many people sieging up the Perry. So let's go right here, go send in more men all the way around. Let's see, how many more? Let's see, how many more men, how many more fronts do we have to actually open up before we conquer all of France? Okay, not very much though. I can always see, not very much. We basically crushed through all France's army. So let's see, there's our front right here. Go right there. Open up a good new front. Let's see. And... Go right... Actually, yeah, you guys combine. You guys go right there, you guys go right there. Yeah, there we go. That should do, that should do. At least I'm not sure. Let's see, and then you guys are going to crush on those guys. Let's see, you guys go right there. You guys go right there. You guys right here. You guys go right there. Yeah, look at all that. Let's go see you guys go right there. This might be a little bit of an issue, so we're going to crush through. Yeah, you guys already know the drill. You guys are going to crush through that army that's pretty much dead. And then once you guys are done with that, then we're going to go conquer all this. Yeah, we're done, everyone. The big, gigantic movement of Ottoman troops against the French, the... One of the last remaining powers, okay, Montenegro, yeah, Montenegro, you guys can get out of this, I don't really care about you guys. <laughs> okay, Serbia, though, you guys are gone. I don't ever want to see your face again. Yes! Alright, and now Greece, I'm going to add a war goal to conquest you guys, too. Okay. Um, and then Luxembourg, do I really have to go send an army to go fight Luxembourg? Hopefully not. I really hope so. I really hope not. Let's go see this. So, most of their land has been destroyed now. I believe we basically defeated all of their remaining troops. I mean, very unlikely they have any more troops that could fight me. They kind of have a good resistance going on over here, but... Uh, we still got we still got all this up here to kind of deal with. I mean, I guess it's just kind of more of a, a pirate victory if they win any battles now, because we basically have all of France... Okay, let's see. Let's go down here. Go down here. Cross through all this. Let's see. Truly is. Truly is. Let's go. 
feed all you guys. Let's see, and then you guys. Palace is now conquered! Yeah! Okay, so let's go right here. Let's go see. You guys go fish out Belfast. Let's go start cleaning up some of the background. <coughs> <coughs> ah, excuse me, people. Let's go start cleaning out some of this background stuff. Alright, and let's see. You guys go right there. You guys go right there. Actually, go start cleaning out some of this background stuff. I hate all these background troops. They're annoying to deal with. Okay. It's like, I don't know where to put... I don't know where I'm supposed to be invading sometimes because it's just like everyone's all scattered. Okay. You guys combine and make a new unit. You guys go to Bordeaux. And let's see. Kaboom! All these guys are finishing up with their sieges. I don't think we have any more sieges for you guys up here. So let's go start cleaning up all of Northern Italy. Or, uh, not Italy. Lower S Hispania. Let's see, that's a decent... Wow, that's a decent sized army. Okay. Let's see, you guys go crush this army. You guys go crush this kind of good conglomeration of armies. Let's go see. Okay, no. Wait, wait. Wait, you guys go right here. Go crush this army. Go crush it. There we go. Alright, you guys all sieging up that land. You guys siege up this land. You guys go siege up this land. You guys go siege up this land. Actually, you guys go help out these guys. Actually, wait, that 50k might be done by that point, so... Yeah, actually, you guys go right here. Uh, we could guess go help. There's no harm in helping. What? Why'd you guys retreat? Oh. France, did you just... Never mind. Go destroy them. Okay. I think France is giving up already. That's nice, but there's still one more place I need to kind of go take over. And then we can call a peace deal. Let me see, are they doing what I want to do? Yes, annex France. I want to do that, don't worry. Don't worry, France, we're going to annex you. We're, go we're going to comply with your generous with your generous offer. But first, what I need to do is I kind of need to destroy the rest of... Uh... Yeah, I need to destroy the rest of this army. I need to conquer... I need to conquer Greece, really. That's, that's really... That's really where we're at right now. We need to conquer Greece. Once we conquer Greece, we're all good. Okay, what I'm going to do, though, is I'm going to go send, like... Let's say... These four armies, you guys start going over here. I'm going to need a decent sized amount of troops to go fight the uh, Chinese. You guys over here, you guys start spreading out on the border. Because I'm really, I'm really kind of a little bit scared of the Chinese. Chinese could be a difficulty, especially with their massive amounts of men. <laughs> they could definitely pose a threat to our empire. Which I don't exactly like, but it's not exactly something I can fix. But you guys go finish off the, uh... Come on, finish off the, uh... Greeks, because I'd love to get this peace deal. I mean, look at this, guys. We could potentially, we could potentially have all France, everyone. In one move, we could potentially have all France. Let's see. Let's see. I mean, they fought, and I'll give them credit. They did fight bravely. They did, they did fight bravely. I love the fact that they, even though they fought immensely more powerful odds, they did fight bravely and they did not give up. But honestly, they knew that they were beaten pretty badly. I mean, this isn't just badly. This is pretty badly. And pretty badly is pretty badly. <laughs> I mean, there's nothing else to say about pretty badly. You pretty much got beaten pretty badly. Okay, I'm gonna stop saying that because I think that might be getting a little bit annoying. Let's go see. 123, yeah. Oh man, France, I, I feel. This must be so annoying for you guys because, like, there was absolutely nothing you guys could do to stop me now. I'm basically at the point where I'm basically too big for you guys to stop. And let's see. Let's see. Is there any more troops being made over here? Did Oh my goodness, there's some kind of civil war going on down there. Okay. Um, I'm assuming that this army is basically all done. Because there's no one else coming over here to go make troops. So I'm going to go start having... going to go start destroying my Greco faction so I can speed this up. I don't want to be in this war forever. Let's see. Okay, you guys go divide up. You guys go send your army right there. You guys go send your army right there. Let's go see, there's a couple good last little bits of French resistance, but I think they're done. They're done. There's like nothing else they can really do about it. Let's go see, you guys go send an army back. There we go. Yeah. Let's see, we have a good line right there. You guys go right here, go crush this army. Uh, yep, everyone, if I want to, I can end the war, but I really want to get some more land from... Uh, our good friends, the uh, Greeks. 
Once the Greeks have been completely conquered, then I can officially declare this war over with. Because of course there's gotta be just an ultimatum besides just the general- Ah, oh, you gotta be kidding me! Well, thank you guys for watching! The decline of the West and the lost generation is apparently my major discovery for the last little bit of this episode, so... Take that as a side of a bad omen? I don't know, so thank you guys for watching. See you guys next time.